We have been serving up kindness all morning long. Gio is outside in Times Square with volunteers for another amazing organization that helps feed people in need. Hey, Gio. Hey, George. I'm out here with folks from City Harvest. It's an incredible organization that gathers food that would otherwise go to waste and delivers it for free to people experiencing hunger. Take a look at this. You've heard of food banks, but how about food rescues? City Harvest is the largest in all of New York, rescuing food that would otherwise go to waste and bringing it to soup kitchens and food pantries across the city. This year, they'll rescue 77 million pounds of food. How can you not want to be a part of that? Ade McCoy has been working with City Harvest for five years, taking GMA along for the ride this week. I pick up a lot of retail, a lot of dry goods, cans, a lot of produce. The first stop, a local supermarket, rolling out several pallets stacked with poultry, fruit, and more. Next stop, Le Bernardin, a three Michelin star restaurant, wheeling out a cart full of fresh food and produce. It's the bread, the good is the bread, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Then the drop off, Holy Apostle Soup Kitchen, just in time for their food pantry. People lining up to get their hands on quality, nutritious food. A lot of times when we pull up in our truck, they're smiling already. They know what they're about to get. So, I mean, that to me, that's that's gratifying. And it's all thanks to the volunteers who help make City Harvest possible. People like Seal Witherspoon, who discovered the organization in the food line herself. And then I realized as I'm standing on the line, I should be on the other side helping out because I could do better over there. For almost a decade, she's been doing her part to make sure everyone has access to a good meal rain or shine it brings kind of like a happiness that you can people can depend on you even if it's for a bag of onions you're there and you can help them out and i am here with that superstar volunteer seal witherspoon from city harvest welcome to the show thank you thank you, know, you. What's so special is you were, you are a volunteer, but yes. you were on the other side of this. Yes. You were standing in that line, yes. you were getting that food. Mm -hmm. So what does City Harvest mean to you? Well, first of all, standing on the other side, I wasn't eating fruits and vegetables. So I was getting the fruits and vegetables I needed, and I didn't have to go on food stamps. That was a big thing. I didn't feel that I needed the food stamps, but City Harvest was here, so that was perfect. So it helped my health with my asthma a lot better. And being on the other side of the line, I realized I could do better if I was on the volunteer end. Yeah. And coming on the volunteer end is perfect for me because a lot of the fruits and vegetables we get, people don't know about. And they don't know how to cook them, so they're like, no, 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 I don't want it. And I tell them, just take one, cook it this way. And if you like it, the next time, take the whole serving. So I told that to a couple of people about spaghetti squash. Just cut it, I put it in the oven, yes. 365 degrees, and then <laughs> scrape it. And they're like, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. They come back, they take the you whole serving You can do a cooking now. segment here on GMA. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, they take the whole <laughs> serving now and they enjoy it. And that's the thing with food insecurity, that it's not just about not having enough that's food. That's what I was telling It's people. not having food with nutritional value. And it's also not knowing yeah. how to cook food. Yeah. Uh, if you knew how to cook the food, you wouldn't be afraid to take it. How do you get to City Harvest to volunteer? How do you get there? How do you? What's your What's your transportation? Oh, oh! When I do <laughs> okay, when I do the mobile markets, I bike. If I'm I'm doing the mobile market in Melrose or Prince Hall. So you do the bike, right? I bike. Don't I, you think it's time for some new wheels? Let's bring out the bike. We got to give Seal a brand new bike. It's yours. It's yours to get there safely, in style. Oh, oh, this is yours. So beautiful. You got a brand new bike right there. Beautiful color, look at it. Even with a little bow. Oh, Olivia, why don't you come over here real quick? Powerful moment here for Seal. You, oh, oh yes, absolutely. You deserve it. You do so much for City Harvest. You do so much for the community. So you deserve and it. I thought just running the marathon was enough. Yeah. She has her marathon medal right here. And Olivia, there. you do so much work for City Harvest. And we think you need a little bit more cash to help you out. So why don't we bring out the check? $25,000 from Uber Eats. 
Everyone is just overwhelmed here. What can you do with that money? What can you do with that well, money? Um, City Harvest is founded actually by volunteers and they're really the backbone of our organization, as you can see with SEAL here. Um, so we really will just go right back into our programs. This cash will go right back into our programs and we'll invest into our communities. Oh, just amazing. All right, well, thank you so much for all you, you do. Thank you. <laughs> Guys, back to you. How inspiring it is to see someone so overwhelmed yeah. by the opportunity to help. Just incredible. <laughs> Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.